Hi guys, welcome to the first ever video. Today we are going to talk about a very unconventional shot pioneered by Tilak Ratne Dilshan in the 2009 T20 World Cup in England. This is one of the most unconventional and almost like a cheeky shot. Because this shot is not for the mind, it is played with the heart. Because the batsman plays this shot intensely over the wicketkeeper's head. When done right, it can result in a great boundary. But when done wrong, it can result in your broken jaw. We've seen it go wrong. Horribly wrong. Miss my four runs. To help me on this quest to learn the Dil Scoop, I've invited a very special friend who's a cricket expert. He's the head coach of KJ Sumaya College and he's been an under-19 former India player. Please welcome Omer Babi. Welcome Hello, sir, it's a pleasure to pleasure meet you finally. To meet you. Yeah. If you want to be a pro like Tilak Ratne Dilshan, then come, we'll show you how it's done. To break down Dil Scoop, yeah. right? We take the stance as a normal batsman. If I'm a right hander, I'm, I'm a right hander, I'm taking a stance. I take my front foot across him, across the pitch, and try and go down on one knee waiting for the ball, watching the ball at the same time and then I just, when the time of impact comes, I just glide the ball with my wrist. After you hit the ball, try and tuck your head towards the ground so that you don't eventually get hit on the jaw or the teeth or the helmet. Right? Cool. Yeah. Cool. Nice sir, you've said it so easily but <laughs> I think it takes a lot of courage to first yeah. generally step down and face the ball at a different angle. Yeah. I also realize that uh, the back lift and the timing of the back lift is important, right? Yes. If you go too early, you pop the ball in the air and you eventually get caught. Or if you're too late, uh, I'm sorry, you need to go to the hospital first. <laughs> no, I need my teeth. I want my full teeth and jaw. So yeah. I just try it, you just tell me. Alright, so step one, looking at the ball, big front foot ahead. Going down on your knee. And then, yes. But, yeah, <laughs> that should but, happen. But you have to be your your head has to be aligned with the bowler. You, and you balances. Should, yeah, in the middle, right? Yeah, it has to be. I also noticed you did like a little turn of the blade. Yeah, just what is uh, that? just a scoop of the wrist because you cannot do this. Okay. You just have to turn a bit of this bat and make it point to the bowler, and then try and yes, we just give it a glide. Towards. Simple. We take the stance. I take my front foot across him, across the pitch and try and go down on one knee and then I just glide the ball with my wrist. After you hit the ball, try and tuck your head towards the ground. Ready to try it out sir, come on let's yeah. go. Knowing how to play is only half the battle. You also need to know when to play the shot. Sir, kab khelna chahiye ye shot? Whenever you execute this shot, you should never play this shot on a full pitch delivery. Of course, because yeah. we know what can happen. Yeah, so it's always on a shorter good length ball, you can actually play the shot. Okay. Just to free the arms and to keep the scoreboard ticking. Alright, and more importantly, if you want to pierce the field where nobody expects the ball to go, yeah. the Dil Scoop is a great option. Thanks a lot for watching the video. Like, share, subscribe, comment, kick, punch. Do whatever you want, but keep scooping. Thanks a lot for watching. Sir, shot. Look at me. What shot, man? What shot, sir? What fantastic shot, man?